that was good. Right there. Oh yeah. What's up, welcome, my name is Tanner Price and in this video we're gonna go over the whole process of buying a job bat and then doing a review on it. So uh, let's get into it. To start off, I bought this bat on May 31st. I'm gonna put a screenshot right here. And today is July 10th. I get it, that's like almost, uh, that's like six weeks almost. And that was kind of to be expected because he said, I mean really, it's he said four to five weeks, Jacob over at job bats. But that's because of Corona, but still it was slightly over. So if you're buying a bat during Corona, don't be like, don't expe expect it to go a little longer unless he catches up. But, um, but either way, we got the bat and, and it's just in time because we got some, a uh, couple good tournaments coming up. Ones that you guys are going to be seeing soon with, uh, with tournament vlogs. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys are going to enjoy those. So if that's for you, definitely subscribe and make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it. Um, without further ado, let's get into the, to the bat opening here. Guys, the same sexy as hell, dude. Alright. If you guys are gonna be able to see it, but we got the um, Tanner Price here. We got the um, gold and gold. And then another thing I didn't know he puts on, but I kind of expected. We got that. Guys, this bed is fucking gorgeous. Holy shit. So we got the end cup here. So uh, I'm pretty excited about this bed. Not sure how it hit, how it swings it. It really, really does feel really, really good in the hand. Oh, by the way, got the ink dot ink dot here. Showing the um, the uh, strands of the, the maple, I guess, or um, tightness of the whatever it's called, the lines. Um, but yeah, holy crap, this thing is gorgeous. So we're gonna go take some BP swings, and uh, I'll see you guys there. Gone forever, Aaron Hernandez. <laughs> For this video, we couldn't just stop at hitting from front toss. We had to go onto the field, and this is where these clips are coming from. So hopefully, you guys enjoy the rest of this video, and then we'll get to the review after these clips. Nope. My man runs like the the Claudio the Chance of Meatball guy. Last one I'm running out. Oh yeah. Guys, I'm in the, the truck. I'm trying. It's the only place I could find that would be so get some quietness, so I could record this uh, this review here. So let's get into it. Job ads, man. They did a good job as they always do. It seems like 
Seems like everybody's loving their bats. Everybody's hitting well with their bats. And I've been swinging. I've been hitting. You know, the sound is good. The sound is good. The pop is good. And I'm swinging with injuries all over the place, man. And I don't. I don't know. I can't wait to be complete 100%. Because when I am, the ball is going to be flying even further. I'm just, you know, when I was swinging, when you guys were watching me swing, I was just injured. So. The model I had, it was a, the a G C S O eight or something like J C S O eight or something like that. Um, and that model, I think it says balanced on the website, but when you put it on, when you put it in your hands, and you have the taper out, it usually usually you feel a little more end load, and I felt, and that's exactly what I felt. So I wouldn't say that this bat is for power hitters only i would say that anybody can use this bat really it's definitely definitely can be a balanced bat i would say it definitely would help if you put on bat tape or a bat grip in my opinion and that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna put on a bat grip and i'm gonna make it a little bit easier for myself and um the, the sweet spot man the sweet spot is really really nice and it's got a lot of room a lot of lot of room to make a mistake, um, which really helps. The taper from the barrel to the handle is really, really small. So that makes, me, so that makes the barrel bigger and gives it more room. And as for that a purpose, I was, uh, I was looking for a bat like that. The types of hitters I think this that should use this bat. If you can use this for a game bat, because obviously you're buying this bat. This is a real custom bat, or custom wood bat. So I would say you're probably gonna use this in, this in games. I would say bigger hitters. I would I would argue bigger hitters for this model bat. For this model bat, I would argue bigger hitters and hitters who can do both. Like they can be contact hitters and power hitters if they want. Well, I wouldn't say any smaller, speedier guys could use this bat because it's it's just a little bit big, you know. It's it's it may be a little too big. Also, another thing, the handle is. Um, small compared to other um, compared to how big the handles can get for other other bats you know but yeah that's that's the end of this review uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this and if you did we got some st. Louis tournament vlog we got a, if you did we have the st. Louis tournament vlog coming up we're about to start I'm about to start recording after I record this because this is about two hours before we leave I have to I'm literally in my underwear right now <laughs> uh, but um, yeah, don't like just be ready because that video is gonna be nice and it's gonna be really fun. And then after that, we got a tournament vlog for the end of our season. I'm tired as hell. I just woke up. Okay, anyway, well, let's just end the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and also subscribe because we're gonna have more videos coming out like this. I'm tired of being inconsistent. I want this stuff to come out. I think it's gonna be just Friday uploads from now on. Um, it's gonna be Friday, up, Friday uploads from or Tuesday uploads from now on Tuesday. Have a good day.